We're building a new rudder for our sailboat. We have the design and now we need a pattern. That's coming up right now. All right, so it's printing out the um, it's printing out the uh, thing, and we get out a here's the uh, here it is, and it should be to scale. This should be. There's only one way to know if this is printed out properly, and that's going to be to measure and make sure four of these make up one inch. I should have about so that that is not to scale. Nope. Okay, so I'm going to have to print it, that, that's no good, yes. Okay, so I figured out the only way this comes out right is if I print it uh, in a landscape, so I have to print this in landscape. Every time I try to print a portrait, it just uh, that doesn't come out right. But now we have the two pieces here, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these two pieces, I'm going to cut them out, and then I'm going to glue, I'm going to tape them together. And I might produce a couple of more copies of this just because I might need them. But this is going to be the profile that I'm going to use. So, okay, took a little bit of wrangling, but um, I was able to get this to print out because it's a 12 inch from here to here, 12 and a half inch almost. It wouldn't go on an 8 and a half by 11 sheet of paper, so without jamming up my printer. All right. So we have uh, cut the pattern out of the um, sheet paper, of course on this one, I mentioned before, I created a 14 inch piece of paper, you're worried about that, putting, by taping two pieces of paper together. Um, and then um, printed this out so I could get everything out on one sheet of paper instead of trying to print two sheets. It'll print out in two sheets, but there's a little bit of problem with the alignment. So I just left that out. So the next step of course is to create now I've got a pattern. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a I'm gonna take a piece of wood and I'm gonna make what I got here is of course a little piece of wood and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna glue this pattern to this piece of wood and then use this little saw to cut that out. If we have some glue. Should have some glue. We have some glue. Excellent, I'm just gonna... All right. And then, uh, I got a little brush here and we'll take this brush and we'll brush down the glue. And put a place where the pattern can stick to it. Get done with this, then I'm gonna brush that in. Okay. Remember, this is the pattern that I'm going to use to follow the uh, the router. So I'm going to give this a little while to dry, and then we'll come back to it. Okay. All right. Now this I can either rinse and use again, or I can toss it out. Uh, I don't think they're that expensive, I've got a whole box of them, so, okay, uh, next, while that's drying, I'm going to try, let's get this thing set up.
four. For the next part, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some uh, put some nails into this thing, solder nails. But I also want to glue this in. Okay, so I'm going to glue this, and I'm going to nail it in. And uh, the, I think, but probably oh, I've already checked. <laughs> okay, so let's just glue the back of this thing here. So we're going to glue it and nail it. And what I've done here is to stand this up in a little box um, to begin with, just so I could see the end a little bit better. And we're probably going to have some excess glue again like we did last time, just spread it around. So. Yeah. And what this will be is the uh, the guide. Now I've already marked the, this. I've made some markings up here so I'm going to say this is the front. Now what I need to do is get this lined up. I've got a center line right there so I know where that's going to be and then I've got a center line over there so I know where that's going to be. And I can see that needs to come down a little bit. Look a little bit crooked, doesn't it? Now I'm just eyeballing this, but I can see that's pretty close to straight. I've got the nail already started. I'm going to hit it, give it a tap. That should be firmly. Now I'm going to get the last back end, and I'm going to get this a tap too. Okay, so that's. Tell it's a solid piece of wood. Alright. Okay, that's my router guide right there. Thanks for watching my program. If you like my videos, be sure and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And for an organized listing of my YouTube videos, go to my website, www.wherearemyplacebos.com, and click on videos. Have a great day.